Why did Mom say we're running low on corn? Well, didn't you hear about the crop failure that's going on? I don't know, let's turn on the TV. News for the citizens of Illinois. Heavy rain across the central U.S. has left millions of acres unseeded. This puts crops at a greater risk for failing. It was reported a farmer from Mineral, Illinois, James McCune, was unable to plant 85% of his intended corn crop. Let's go to Amanda for more information. Oh, we're on point. Thank you, Julia and Rose. Farmers are desperate. Crops such as corn due to extreme weather have failed. Local families in this area heavily rely on the crops that are now failing. They just want to break even this year. I'm out here in the field with Farmer Faith. Faith, come tell us more about your crops in 2019. So this this growing season's this growing season's been pretty bad because I've just been trying to grow my corn but I can't because my soil is so unfertile. My consumers and the people that I sell to, they haven't I haven't made much profit because of how I've been doing lately. What do you think is causing this problem? Ah, uh, it's the flooding in my field really because it's been raining so much lately. That's a Madison, an agricultural engineer. Thanks, Amanda. I went to Penn State University where I studied agricultural engineering for many years. We collaborate with bioengineers bio to produce crops that can resist pesticides and overwatering by combining them with DNA from other plants. In order to improve the quality and quantity at which plants are grown, technology is crucial. 38% of land on Earth is used is used to grow crops. As population increases, the demand for crops also increases. 93% of corn on earth is genetically engineered to fit the growing population. 